Hey everybody, thanks for joining me today as we enjoy this amazing hobby together. Um, today's episode is going to be really unique and really special because we're going to be doing a few things. We're going to be first going through a quick mail day, and then we're going to do our 75 subscribers giveaway, and then we're going to rip open this box of 2021 Panini Elite Extra Edition Blaster Box here. So... I'm pretty excited to open this up. I think it cost me like 30 bucks, but it was, and it only has five cards. So we'll see. We'll see. We'll see if it's worth it or not, all right? So if you're new to my channel, welcome. Um, if you're new to the channel, I just want to let you know that I like to rip my product up slowly. And when I rip open this one, um, you know, I like to take my time because this hobby is expensive and it's hard to find retail product at retail prices, right? And if you're also new to the channel, um, then you know that you need to subscribe, right? So today we're going to give away this blaster box of 2021 WNBA basketball. And I know some of you guys are watching this video and you're like, oh man, I missed out on it. But don't worry, because once we hit 100 subscribers, we're going to be giving away not five, but six packs of baseball cards here, right? We got Update, Heritage, Optic, Chronicles, Mosaic, and Prism Baseball. Um, I picked, originally I was only going to be giving away five, but I found this at Target. And these have been popping up at Target um, all over the country. More Prism Baseball cello packs. And so I was like, you know what? I'm going to buy it and throw it in here as well. So we've got six cello packs of baseball that we're going to be giving away. So, yes, please subscribe, all right? You guys don't want to miss out on that. So, let me see. I don't know. We'll do it like this. Let's see. We'll slide that out of the way here. So, but first, yes, yeah, so we're going to be doing three things today. Quick mail day. Um, and then we're going to do the giveaway. And then we're going to be opening up this blaster box here. All right. Um, so yeah, mail day was, well, you know, I, I've been buying a lot of stuff, but I haven't bought, um, a lot of it hasn't come in yet. So some of it did. And so I'll kind of share with you guys what I've got so far. I've got picked up these, um, I'm trying to complete the set of pink, um, Panini Prism baseball stained glass cards. I cracked open a Mike Trout and I've been slowly buying the other four pink um, parallels of this card. And so here's my Juan Soto. And I think I've got my, I've got an Aaron Judge coming as well, but it's not going to get here until Wednesday. So, um, you know, I'll do an update on that whenever it gets here. So, but very cool. Once I get that fifth card, I'll do a video of all five of that complete set. So, but yeah, I get picked up a lot. Um, there's five of them, and I'll probably just send these four to Comsey. And sell them on Comsey. So there we go. Juan Soto's. Very nice. Oops. I don't know. We'll put them right here. Hopefully he fits. Nope. Okay, you know what? We're gonna go. We're gonna we're gonna go with this card stand right here. Juan Soto 2021 Prism and Baseball Pink Parallel. And then we also got this, a Project 70 card. I don't buy a whole lot of Project 70s. They're, they're um, you know, they're 20 bucks each, and then with shipping and everything, you're paying about 22 bucks. And some people question, you know, are those cards really worth 20 bucks? Mm, I, I think if you're a flipper, I don't think they're worth it. You know, if you're an investor, I don't, mm, I wouldn't, I don't know if they're really worth it, really, as well from like an investing standpoint, unless you get a rookie card. You know, they did recently release like a Ryan Mountcastle rookie card um, in the Project 70 set. And so, I mean, that might be worth something in the future. Who knows? You know, but I did pick up this card and I'm super excited about it right here. It's, I know it's a crazy looking card, huh? Right. But it's a Greg Maddox card. Um and the cool thing about this Maddox one is that it's, he's actually in his Cubs uniform, right? He's got 
the Cubs hat there, Chicago Cubs. It's got the little cubby bear right there. It's got a mad dog right there, because that's one of his nicknames, Mad Dog, right? Right? He's got like one, two, three feet, one, two, three, four arms. Right. I don't know. I I saw that card and I was like, dude, that's a really cool card. Like that's kind of crazy, but I like it. And so here it is. Here's the back. It's a Greg Maddox card. And this piece of art was created by by F dot. So that's really cool right there. E F dot F dot. So I really I, I saw this card and I was just like, who is that? And I was like, oh, no way, it's a Greg Maddox card? And then I looked at it closer, and I was like, oh, dude, it's a Chicago Cubs Greg Maddox card, not a Braves or a Dodgers Greg Maddox card. And I was like, I, I've got to get that. i got to get that. And so, yeah, I picked up one of these, and I absolutely love it. It says Mad Dog right there, number 31. Yeah, absolutely love it, man. Beautiful-looking card. So cool-looking. All right, so we'll put that on a stand as well. All right, and so we are now. I'm actually gonna cut away from this screen, and I'm gonna we're gonna do the 75 subscribers giveaway, and then we'll come back to this shot here, and we're going to do the opening of the um, 2021 Elite Extra Edition Baseball Blaster. All right, so I'll see you guys in the next segment here. All right, everybody, so we're going to do the 75 subscribers giveaway. Remember, we're giving away this blaster box of 2021 WNBA basketball. Sorry if the video looks, the lighting looks kind of blown out, but I kind of have to do it like that so that you can see the screen and everything. And so as of the recording of this video, I have 79 subscribers. I seriously had 75 subscribers like two days ago, and now I have 79. So... What we're going to do is we're first going to go down here and we're going to see who all of my subscribers are. So this is within the last 90 days. Let's go to a lifetime. And we have currently 39. So even though I have 75 subscribers, only 39 of them are public subscribers. By I think by default, YouTube makes you a private subscriber because they want to, you know, most people want to keep that information private. but uh, And so that's what YouTube does. They keep you as a private subscriber, right? But in order to be entered in these giveaways, I need you to be a public subscriber. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to a random number generator. And we're going to just randomly pick a number 1 out of 39. And then I'm just going to count down here. Just count down to whoever it is, all right? All right, so let's do this. Oh my gosh, that's so blown out. Okay, much better. Woo. All right, so we're gonna go one through, let's go one, let, let me see how many times I'm going to roll, uh, randomize the one through 39 list, just so that it just isn't like the first time. And it, it, just so it's more random, all right? So we're gonna roll the one through 39 list four times. All right, cool. So here we'll go 39, and here's the first one. That's the first one. It's 15. Second one is 35. The third one is 8. And whoever is 30th on the list is going to be the winner of this 2021 WNBA Blaster Box. Okay, number 30. Congratulations here. So we got... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. Here we go. The next person on this list is going to be the winner. 
Number 30 is Jason VT Sports Guy. Awesome. Jason, congratulations. You are the winner of this 2021 WNBA Basketball Blaster. I'll be contacting you. And if you see this video, um, feel free to contact me as well. I'll go to your YouTube page and I'll drop a comment in your most recent video. And I'll try to send you a direct message. And if you've got contact information in your YouTube profile, I'll contact you through there as well. So congrats to Jason and VT Sports Guy. Um, you won, man. And so if you didn't win, don't worry, all right? Once we get to 100 subscribers, we're going to be giving away six packs of baseball cards. There are six cello packs. We got Update, Heritage, Optic, Chronicles, Mosaic, and I just decided to add Prism Baseball to all of that as well. So sorry if the color of these packs in this box looks weird. Um, I have like an auto... Uh, not autofocus, but like, I don't know what it is when I'm, I'm trying to say. I've got like a, some auto feature on my camera right now. So that's why the color looks weird. But yeah, congrats to Jason, VT Sports Guy. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and open up that blaster of, uh, of Elite Baseball, All right? I'll see you guys in the next segment here. Hey, everybody. Okay, so welcome back and congrats again to the winner. Please contact me. I'm going to... Leave a comment in the video here tagging you, and I'll go to your video. I'll go to your channel, and I'll try to uh, leave a comment in your most recent video as well. And I'll try to contact you every single way that I can um, in hopes that you will be able to get your blaster box of 2021 WNBA basketball. Um, so now we are going to be ripping open this box right here. It's a blaster box of 2021 Elite Extra Edition. There's only five cards in this box. And I think this box is going for like 25 or 30 bucks. And there's only five cards. So, I mean, we'll see, you know, if it's worth it. You know, I mean, for five cards, that's, that's a pretty big gamble there. And so the cool thing about this box is that you are guaranteed two autos or memorabilia cards. Per box on average. And I'm hoping that I don't get two mem cards. That would that would kind of suck. I would rather get I would I want autographs, right? And the cool thing about this product here is that it's a lot of prospects. Um I don't know if there's any rookies, but go ahead and feel free to pause the video and read through this information if you want to. I don't know if there's rookies in here. I think there might be rookies, but I think it's mainly all prospects. And let me see here, let me grab my Card stands here because we know I know we're gonna get some hits. And let me see, I've got my thicker um, top loaders and everything too ready to go. My thicker card sleeves as well. I need those just in case that happens here. Is something good pops up? Sorry, I'm kind of going off camera here, and I'm gonna just grab. A checklist of some cards here and so let's see who we get here so there should be only like one pack in here there it is one pack right there let's see who we get here I do have another box of this stuff about two boxes and so we'll probably open up that other box sometime in the future and so yeah there there we go it's really nice Oh, man. Okay. Oh, I think I saw a thick card in there. So, let's see here. So, uh, it's going to show us a card right, right off the front here. So, we'll just get ready here and just, we'll just see who it is. Oh, Sale Frelick. Very nice. Uh, looks like we did get a Mem card. All right, which is good. We didn't get two mem cards. And self relic is I can't read that off the glare of my computer. Okay, that's six hundred twenty-six out of nine hundred ninety-nine. Very nice. Self relic for the Milwaukee Brewers. All right, so our next card is a mem card. Let's see here. Um, 
guess we'll just show it who it is. Okay, Carson Tucker. That name sounds familiar. Um, but before we look too much at him, let's just look at this self relic card. I guess these are the base cards here. No stats, but um, yeah, I'm, I haven't heard of a, heard of Sale, but I don't. I'm not a big baseball prospector. I open up a lot of Bowman, but um, I, I'm still trying to learn as much as I can about that world of the hobby here. But here's Self Relic, the back of it. Very nice. And Carson Tucker. Here's the back of him. Let's see here. Enclosed player worn slash used material is guaranteed by Panini, which is awesome. All right. So let's see. Future threads. All right. Make sure I grabbed all of it. I don't want to reveal the next card. Very nice. Just a little white napkin of Carson Tucker for the Cleveland Indians. Very nice. Okay. So let's see what our next card is here. And it's, I think this is our auto. So, I don't know, we'll just go straight through. Um, makes sense that they would put the auto in the middle. Um, so let's, I don't know, what should I do? Let's save the auto for last. Let's see here. So behind the auto, we've got Joe Rock, pitcher for the Colorado Rockies. And this is numbered out of 199. And it is a die cut card, which is really nice. I don't know anything about Joe Rock. Let's see here. And the card behind Joe Rock is of Dustin Sens. All right. Elite Extra Edition. Dustin Sens for the Washington Nationals here. Very cool. That one's not numbered, but um, oh, Joe Rock is 116 out of 199. All right. That's interesting. All right. So let's sleeve up these three cards first. You know, so... Um, yeah, like I said, like I haven't opened up any Bowman draft. You know, I mainly open up retail stuff. So, um, I don't know much about Bowman draft. And so I'm thinking some of these guys might be in Bowman draft because I know Henry Davis was in Bowman draft. And what was the other one? Bowman draft, Bowman's Bowman's best. I didn't open up any Bowman's Best either since that wasn't um, a retail product. Oops. And so I don't know much about these college prospects here. Okay, here we go. Um, behind Carson Tucker is... I'm just going to flip the card over. Flip everything over and we'll see who the auto is of. All right, you guys ready? All right, here we go. It is uh, Ryan Spikes from Tampa Bay. All right. That's not too bad. Is that on card too? Oh, that is on card as well. That's pretty sweet. All right, we'll put Carson right there. But um, I don't know. Yeah, you never know. Ryan Spikes. That name does not sound familiar, but I'm going to do some research. That's the cool thing about opening up these prospect cards too is that I enjoy doing the research. I enjoy going on to fan graph and Baseball reference and reading up about these players. So let's see. Most of the scouting reports on Spikes notes the uh, two top tier traits: blazing speed and quick fire arms. Okay, so maybe he's a defensive guy. Very cool. He's from Lilburn, Georgia. That's funny because my brother-in-law and I've got some family members who, for a long time, lived in Lilburn, Georgia. So oh, that's pretty cool. I wonder what high school my brother-in-law went to. So, Lilburn's a George, uh, suburb of Georgia, of Atlanta. So, it is Ryan Spikes. All right. So, that's, I've got my thick sleeves, too. So, we'll sleeve up Carson Tucker, and we'll see. We'll see what happens with these guys. You know, one of, any of these guys could blow up. Any of these guys could become the next Bobby Witt, Julio, Franco. You never, never know. So, yeah, there we go. There's my blaster box of 2021 Elite Extra Edition. Um, so, uh, I just want to thank all of you. Um, you know, we hit 75 subscribers, and uh, I'm really surprised that we did. Um, and so, I really appreciate all of you who are subscribed and who um, believe in this channel and believe in me. And so, thank you. I really appreciate it. So, 
if you all could, um, please like, comment, subscribe if you're not, um, click that notification bell. Um, I'm making a bunch of videos, and I'm having a lot of fun doing it, and I would love you all to enjoy um, all of that as well with me. And so, I guess I'll say goodbye now, all right? So all of you out there, uh, take care of yourselves and take care of those that you love. I'll see you all in the next video.